Hello dear students, welcome back to Royson Creations YouTube channel. In this channel, let us analyze state level preparatory examination science question paper with answer. Those who are watching first time, please subscribe and please share with your friends. So already you have completed science examination. So today we are going to discuss the key answer. Part A physics here first main is multiple choice question three ma three question will be there first question the device that convert electrical energy into mechanical energy the device is a electric motor so option E is the answer second question the element used in making a solar cell is iron zinc oxygen silicon is used to make the solar cell so option D is the right answer third question at the time of short circuit the current in the circuit what happens in the circuit it increases heavily the overflow of current will be there so the option C increases heavily is the right answer second main answer the following questions here two questions are there each questions carry one marks fourth question what is electric current the rate of flow of electric charges is called as a electric current fifth question a bar magnet is inserted into a coil and withdrawn as shown in the figure mention the principle that is found here so here there is a circuit is there in that in the coil when they are passing the magnetic bar what happens this will give the emi that means electromagnetic induction so therefore the answer is the electromagnetic induction main answer the following questions here three questions each questions carry two marks sixth question draw the schematic diagram of an electric circuit comprising electric cell electric bulb ammeter and flucky so here is the diagram if you draw on this one you will get two marks seventh question observe the given figure name the i defect indicated in this figure and mention the lens used to correct this so we have to find out that is which type of disease and which lens is going to use to correct the disease the first one is it the defect is myopia or short sightedness so it can be corrected by using concave lens of appropriate power eighth question write four characteristics of good source of energy or write the effect used due to the overuse of fossil fuels here option is there any one question you can answer first question it should be easily available it should be easy to transport it should be easy to store it should be economical so if it is a fuel is if it is good means this character should be there and the second question is uh, write the effects of causes the uses of over uses of fossil fuels so what happens means pro it produces harmful polluting gases such as carbon dioxide carbon monoxide and sulfur dioxide then uh, carbon dioxide is a greenhouse gas which is responsible for global warming and pollutants uh, that leads to early death heart attacks respiratory disorders sunstroke and asthma fourth main answer the following questions here three questions are there each question carry three marks explain the experiments to state a current carrying conductor experiences mechanical force when that conductor is placed in a magnetic field so here you have to write the experiment so i just have given the answer you copy the answer otherwise you can see the textbook easily you can write the answer 10th question draw the ray diagram to show the image formation by a concave mirror when the object is kept between c and f of the mirror with the help of ray diagram mention the position and nature of the image formed so here c center of curvature f is the principal focus so this is the figure c here object is there in between c and f so when the object is in between c and f it form the image beyond the center of curvature and it is a real and a inverted image so if you have written this much you will get three marks 11th question explain the experiment conducted by newton to show that white light contains seven colors or your option is there explain the relation between the colors of scattered light in the atmosphere and the size of the scattered particles on on the basis of this re relation explain the reason for blue color of the sky so first question we'll take sir isaac newton was the first to use the glass prism to obtain the 
spectrum of a sunlight so it tried to split the colors of the spe uh, spectrum of the white light further by using another similar prism then he placed a second identical prism in an inverted position with respect to the first prism allowed all the colors of the spectrum to pass through the second prism he found a beam of white light emerging from the other side of the second prism this observation gave newton the idea that the sunlight is made up of seven colors and the second question answer is this color is scattered light depends on the size of the scattering particle very fine particles scattered mainly blue light while particles of large size scattered light of longer wavelengths if the size of the scattering particles is large enough then the scattered light may even appear white in color then why the sky is looks blue color because the fine particles in the atmosphere can scatter the blue light which has the shorter wavelength and red light which has a longer wavelength so the sky looks blue in color fifth main answer the following questions here two questions carry eight marks twelfth question a question the resistors r1 is equal to 2 ohm r2 is equal to 4 ohm and r3 is equal to 4 ohm are respect are parallelly connected in an electric circuit that comprises six hole to battery then calculate the total resistance in the circuit and total current flowing in the circuit so here first we can see the first question so they have given R1, R2, R3 in the parallel series. So they are connected parallelly. So first we have to find out the RP. Then we can go with the I. So first you take R1 is equals to 2 ohm, R2 is equal to 4 ohm, and R3 is equal to 4 ohm. So we they have they are given already 6 ohm. Therefore RP is equals to R1 by R1 plus 1 by R2 plus 1 by R3 because the total resistance of two resistors. That are in connected in parallel means this is the formula. So now you take 1 by Rp is equals to 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 4. So you take LCM, then you will get 2 plus 1 plus 1. So uh, 4 divided by 4, 4, 4 get cancelled 1. Therefore, total resistance in parallel connection Rp is equals to 1 ohm. Then you have to find out total resistance of two resistors that are conducted in parallel. I is equals to V by R. Therefore, B is equals to 6 divided by 1. So, 6 ohm. Therefore, the first question answer is 6, ohm, 6 amps and 1 ohm. 13th question, A question. Write any two differences between convex lens and concave lens. B question, a ray of light traveling in a air enter obliquely into water. Does the light ray be bend towards the normal or away from the normal? Why? So first you write the differentiate between concave lens and convex lens. So here the differences between convex and concave lens is given. So just you copy that. Then the second question answers that also I have given. The ray bends towards the normal. Why? Because the ray of light goes from water medium to denser medium because of that it bent towards the normal the next part is part b chemistry fourth main 14th question calcium oxide reacts vigorously with water to produce slactiline the type of calcium reaction is it is the answer is combination reaction option b is the right answer 15th question a structure of an unsaturated carbon uh, compounds among the following is that is the benzene option a is the right answer directly i given one, uh, one answers 16th question the element belongs to the same period in modern periodic table an element has largest atom is that is potassium 39c is the option next uh, seventh main answer the following questions here three questions are there 17th question 2 Ag Br gives to 2 Ag plus Br2. This chemical reaction in the endothermic reaction. Why? Why? Because it absorbs light energy. So only it belongs to endothermic reaction. Why? Because aluminium bromide is absorb the sunlight. Then it uh, it absorb the heat. So then it give up the aluminium and the bromium. So there what happens? It absorbs the that reaction absorb the sunlight. Because of that it is a endothermic reaction 18th question mentioned two limitations of newland cla newland's classification of elements why because it applicable only up to the calcium and many element discovers in future and he did not follow the law of octets 19th question how ethanol can be converted into ethanoic acid 
ethanol is converted into ethanoic acid by the addition of oxygen released by the potassium permanganate in the reaction mixture next eighth main answer the following question 20th question write one differences between the oxidation and reduction reaction write an example for each type in the form of an chemical reaction so oxidation means it loses oxygen during the reaction so example also i have given reduction means if a substance gain oxygen during the reaction that is we call as a reduction so example also is there so you can give any example it should be a relative to the oxidation and reduction next question what is the neutralization reaction how can any solution be identified as a neutral by using litmus paper or what are alkalis right two uses of sodium hydroxide carbonate that means baking soda so neutralization reaction means the reaction between acid and base gives salts and water that is called neutralization reaction if how we are going to find out that is neutral or not means if neither the red nor the blue paper changes when you are dipped into the solution that paper it doesn't change to blue or red then that material it, itself it is a neutral so here another question what are alkalis it is a base that can dissolve in water and form a alkaline solution and use uh, what are the uses of baking soda i given 22nd question a part of modern periodic table is given below observe the answer and following the question so here they have given the table so we have to write which elements having plus 1 and minus 1 valency obviously sodium having plus 1 because it is donating one electron so it become positive so sodium positive electro positive and chlorine will receive one more electron so that will become negative hagagi chlorine and sodium is the answer b question organ is placed in the 18th group why because it is a inert gas or noble gas or zero group element because of that it kept in the 18th group elements next ninth main answer the following questions here three questions will be there draw the diagram of the arrangement of the apparatus to show that acid solution in water conduct electricity so i have given the diagram just you have to practice 24th question magnesium forms ionic compound with chlorine why explain or aluminum oxide is amphoteric acid whereas sodium oxide is a basic oxide why write suitable chemical equation so for the both question also i have given the answer so you have to learn for the future uh, for your uh, next final exam you have to learn all the equations everything so concentrate on the state level question paper next 25th question how zinc metal extracted from zinc carbonate and zinc sulfide so the crude zinc sulfide ore is heated strongly in excess of air zinc sulfide is converted into zinc oxide this process only we called as a roasting so i have given the equation the crude zinc carbonate ore is heated strongly in limited supply of air zinc carbonate is converted into zinc oxide this process is known as a calcination so the zinc oxide is reduced to zinc by using the reducing agent such as a carbon next 10th main answer the following year four marks question is there a a question carbon atom neither loses nor gain the electrons explain this statement scientifically how are ester formed how can so be obtained from the ester so you are also have given the answer i need not to explain because you are already learned so just i have given the answer you copy it the next part is part c biology their 11th main 27th question the correct path of the moment of no impulses in neuron is option a dendrites axon nerve ending and cell body 28th question the material that takes more time to change their form and structures are that is ddt bhc and insecticides so 12th question answer the following questions the 29th question daughter cell generated by the division of bacterium cells are more similar to the each other why why because the process of nuclear division in cell that produces daughter cell that are genetically identical to each other and to the parent cell 30th question write two problems caused by the construction of large dams because there they will face social problems so that means the effects of construction of large dam across the river economic problems also will be there because it's all of the huge amount of the public money next environmental problem also is there that is they contribute enormous to deforestation and loss of biological 
diversity. Thirty-first question: In the conservation of environmental reuse method is better than the recycling method. Why? It saves the energy as it requires as an ample amount of energy in remanufacturing the products. Thirteenth main answer the following questions. Thirty second question: Functioning of reflex arc is more efficient than the thinking process of the brain. Clarify this statement with scientific explanation. Because a reflex arc more efficient in animal because the thinking process of brain is not fast enough in many animals. It can function in the absence of true thought process and increases the changes of survival. Number thirty-three. Construct below given types of the food chain that comprises algae, aquatic birds, large fish, and small fish. Food chain that slows the flow of energy in the increasing order second one food chain that slows the flow of harmful chemicals in the increasing order so the first one option is bird large fish small fish and algae then the second answer is algae small fish large fish and birds next 14th main answer the following question explain the role of nose and alveoli in the human respiratory systems so for both also answer is here so just you copy it Question number thirty-five. What are the hormones secreted by the following glands? Right, one function of each of them: thyroid gland, adrenaline gland, and testes. And what is the geotropism? Which part of the plant shows negative geotropism? Right, the function of the plant hormones. So, thyroxine hormone will secrete thyroxine. Hormone acts as a regulator of the metabolic rate of the body. Adrenaline gland. it secretes adrenaline hormone one function of adrenaline hormone is adrenaline triggers the body fight or flight response so that means emergency hormone and then uh, th uh, testes will secrete testosterone hormone testosterone is involved in the development of the male secondary sex characteristics so here another one more question is there that is geotropism that means the movement of plant part in response to gravity is called geostropic moment that phenomenon is called as a geotropism shoot of the plant shows a negative tropism because it is away from the earth it is going towards the sun so it is a negative part of the geotropism and plant hormones control all the growth and development activities like cell division enlargement flowering seed formation 36th question question number 36 first question how did uh, mendel identify the tall traits as the dominant and the short traits as the recessive traits in the experiment conducted on the plants b question give illustration to prove that the complicated organs such as high evolved in stages so for that also i have given answer just to copy so you know very well heart diagram so i have not given the heart diagram last main answer the following questions here one question will be there five marks question what are uh, differences between the fragmentation and the regeneration method of reproduction what are the reasons for increasing the accumulation of variation in sexual reproduction explain menstruation that occurs in women so both also answer also i have given so you have to practice children practice thoroughly and get good marks in the final exam and uh, all the best for your exam